New at 6, it's the end of an era for a well-known restaurant and bar in downtown Middletown. First and last taverns closing its doors for good tonight. This after two decades in the city. Channel 3 Alvarez News reporter Aya Galal has more. You kind of walk around with a heavy heart looking that you're not going to be coming here. Tony Skaka has owned First and Last Tavern for the last two and a half years. Tonight, his restaurant is serving up its final meals and drinks before closing up shop one last time. Kind of empty. You know, you get an empty feeling inside your stomach. The restaurant is being evicted amid an ongoing feud with the city. It's a sad thing. Nobody wants that to happen, yeah. you know, but you stay positive, you move forward. The city owns the building and says the restaurant is behind on thousands of dollars in rent. And tonight, customers say they are sad to see the place go. And it's a blow. It's a blow to, to me, to the business, and to the whole community. Jennifer comes to first and last frequently with friends from her business. She says she wanted to be here for the last day and show her support. First and last has really been our home for the past few years. This has been the place that we come to strategize what we're going to do, plan out our season. While Tony says there were a lot of challenges to maintaining the restaurant, he says he'll miss his employees and customers who've become family. They enjoyed coming in here. They enjoyed the food. They enjoyed the service. Now the chain does have locations in other towns across Connecticut, but as for Tony, he says he's not sure where he's going to go next. Reporting in Middletown, Aglal, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.